We are currently having a snowfall, I mean, a cold winter warning. And my window, ah, my window is so old. Um, the sun has been shining all day. These are two of uh, Eric's friends trying to come through the yard and Look how much snow they have to go through. Where did they? They found that's where Francis shovels up to. That's how deep it is. Crazy. And this is from this side. A window is dirty, and the condensation. It's so cold. It's extremely, extremely, extremely cold. Right there. <laughs> so here is the nursery. Current state. Still messy. Um, I, I decided I'd love to keep this tree out all year. I don't know, I just like the white glow. I did not put up my lights yet. Like, the curtain lights. I do have um, a few dolls up here. Oh, here's my YouTube bag. That one looks dirty. Looks dirty. I don't know what happened. These are my vintage real huggies like from 2003 so what I had on my real sons but I bought treated myself with those a while ago I have lots of diapers I collect diapers too <laughs> I collect everything so here is Katsik looking cute Daniel, looking sweet, Waverly, they're the same, I think I had them also on here the last time, and in here is my tripod, I want to change Julia, she is right there, my Anastasia, and here is Leandra, Leandra Camille, and she is Ash and Drake breathing. She has, um, let's see if I can find it without. And she breathes. Oh, oh my goodness. I love how that feels. It feels real, guys. It feels like a real stomach. I don't know if you can. <laughs> you can't really tell. Let's see if I. Oh, I love. Oh my goodness! I just want to cry because their stomach feels so real. I mean, you can hear the motors, and she has a heartbeat. And there's Panette. My wigged beauty. She has a wig. Oh, imagine if her eye would open. Oh my goodness. That would totally freak me out if her eye opened. She is so realistic. I love her. Okay. But I want to put, I want to talk about Julia a little bit. I love her. I love the Anastasia kit. But I don't like how her hair is done. And I'll show you that when I get ready to change her. So here's Julia Rain. And oh my goodness. Now I'm going to be in the shadows. Oh my goodness. Okay, I need to put you over here. I'm going to see if turn there's shadows. Oh, this light is on. Oh. And I didn't. I put you on a different, 
I don't even have an LED light. Well, I do. Yeah, I'm sorry if there is any shadows. Oh my goodness. But it seems, it still seems dark in here. Turn on this light. Shut the door. Don't get any sound. Move my chair over. Um, I love Julie Rain and I've tried everything with her hair. Her hair is very unique. I've tried this stuff works amazing on normal rooted hair, but she does not have normal rooted hair and even have a toothbrush and I tried like but I think the artist applied her hair. And I had Julia Rain. I had Julia here for a long, long time, like 2015, before applied hair was even spoken about. <sighs> And I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like how her hair is very extremely coarse. Is but I love her. Her painting is phenomenal. And I love her eyelashes. And I love her redness. I love her little earrings. She came with them. And I love how her limbs are done. Like, she's done by Lucy Giald from Quebec, and she was the first doll that I bought from Lucy from eBay. She's not on eBay anymore. She hasn't been on eBay for many, many years. Her fact, her website now is um, not completely updated, so I'm not sure what happened to Lucy. She's She's older. But um, I love her painting. I really do. Like, oops, sorry. Like, she matches, like, my skin tone and her skin tone. Like, I'm very, very fair. I have red patches. I have, like, extremely white patches. <laughs> Black hair. Um, but I want to put this on Julia. This came with Francine. This came... Oh, and that's a video I want to talk about. They're the very first three dolls in my collection, uh, excluding Emily. So four dolls. There's Emily Faye. She is exactly the same as when I bought her. 2015, she was used. My second very doll, Francine. She came with this. And sadly, Francine is now in severe need of repair. Her paint, I don't, sorry, it's sad. Her paint rubbed off. And I really loved her. So her paint rubbed off, sorry. And then I had a third baby. And it was Jamie Summer, and I bought her brand new from eBay, and she is exactly the same. I want to talk about that. I want to talk about my first few babies in my collection and how are they holding up after all of these years. Because I have a few babies in my collection, their paint did rub off, and it's disappointing when that happens. I don't know how to repair them, but one day I will. I will know how. To repair them but anyways here is julia i could never repair i don't even know how to repair this but she does look amazing in headbands so i will do that for her she is oh she's so precious so this came with francine when i first got her francine is my Ember Kit by Tasha Endelem. 
and she was reborn. I forget her name because she hasn't been around in many, many years. But she's from BC, I remember that. And she she was influenced by England quite a lot. And I think I forget her name. Oh look, this fits her well. Oh, I'm so happy. Because Julia looks so cold. By the way, that like I said, it's so freezing cold here. We're like in the minus 40s, and that's both Fahrenheit and Celsius. So it's extremely, extremely cold. By the way, thank you to all the people who comment nice things. When, when I say I ramble, which I do, I keep coming on to a topic and then changing my mind and talking about something else. I get distracted very easily. So I'm pretty sure that I... There's a form of, like, FASD, but I'm born in the era where they never tested you on those different things. So, but I bet you I do. Oh, my goodness. I love, this is gorgeous on her. Oh, my goodness. I just, <laughs> aw, she's so cute. Look, it's Julia Rain, the Anastasia sculpt. She reminds me a lot like the uh, the Rosalie, which I also love. But oh my gosh, she's so cute! Oh, and I love this beautiful. This was inspired by um um. Let's, well, first of all, let's see what brand. It is because the artist always loves things from England. I think she is English herself. So, or British, I should say. Oh, this is just by what kind of baby? I can't see without my reading glasses. Some sort of baby. I can't see. Well, I can't. Oh my goodness. I can't see. Okay, I have my reading glasses. So, <laughs> oh, vitamins, baby. Vitamins, just getting on. Made in China, newborn. So, and this goes with it. So beautiful. Vitamins, baby. So, I'm not sure if that really is a UK or not, but. Very beautiful. And it fits Julia so beautifully. So happy. Oh, she's so beautiful. Okay, now, what if I would turn off this light? If I can. Okay. I turn off the light. Oh my goodness, she's so busy. The headband is just better. It hides. I mean, it shows that she has some hair, but it hides the fact that it's like coarse hair. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Yeah, you can tell. Oh, oh I just want to cut the hair. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, she grabbed, she grabbed onto my necklace. She grabbed onto my necklace. Aww. <laughs> this is Julia. Oh, she's happy. <laughs> so, news guys, hope that you're having a great day. Hope that you're having a good, happy new year. Thank you for all the positive comments down below. I really appreciate all of you being here so much. It means a lot. I am a little sad lately because um, I am a supply teacher, a substitute teacher, and all the schools in Manitoba where I live are in 
remote learning so I can't even teach which means I can't even get income so I need a permanent job I really do I need to get back into the school system completely so it's hard it's been tough so but anyways guys I love you all thank you so much for being here and until next time hopefully very soon until next time guys bye I love you much time guys